Hello everyone, it's 20 Italians bringing you another episode of the Elvish Chronicles using the fantasy mod for Crusader Kings 2 created by Jordan Does CK2. You can see Jordan's channel at the bottom of my channel's homepage, all the way at the bottom. Just scroll down and you'll see a link to his channel there. Um, so, you've noticed if you're paying that close attention to, which I hope that you are, that you are loving this so much that you notice every little detail that I don't. But if you did notice, the date has been progressed since when I last stopped it. And the reason for that is, is that um, I do want to become an empire, and I noticed that my coin was a bit low. So, uh, off, off camera, off recording... I've uh, been ransoming prisoners. So I ransomed the Baron that we got, then I've been ransoming uh, ransomed some people off to the Duke of Cornwall, and then I saw that some of these people he's willing to pay 46 coins for. Like this one. Umrilithin... I don't know how you say that. So, free money. War is always lucrative. How about I actually lower my levies? There we go. Nope, nope. Alright, we actually have one more. And then I'll just release all the others. Alrighty. Well, there you go. So, what's happening down here? Still nothing, thankfully. No wars whatsoever. Well, no orc wars against elves that I have to worry about. So, I need to worry about the Duke of Moray, though. And to do that, I'm going to take away his power base by offering him vassalization again. No, doesn't like me. See, why can't I just claim the Duchy of Moray? Well, I guess when I take enough, I'll just uh, surf it. No. Oh. Well, how can I... Why can't I call the, du the Duke of Moray? Or the Duke of Orkney, then, in... It's an unfortunate name for an elf. Um, but you're my tributary, are you not? Am I only allowed one tributary? I'm only allowed one vassal? Oh, huh. I guess I'm only allowed one. Alright, well... Well, okay then. Didn't realize it was like that. Yes, of course. Of course, my liege. I like how so willing they're they're willing to turn on their on their allies. Oh, look at that! Three thousand men out of the capital duchy. Just my dog, just trying to keep her happy. I suppose she wants to go out or something, but gotta wait till this one's over. Is this his entire army up here? No, oh, we want to. We destroy the whole thing. That's fine. I don't believe you. Alright. So we should have enough then. Should have enough money after this. Clearly enough money. To uh, set up the empire. That's her. She's rubbing around in her dog bed. I don't know what she's trying to do. Uh, those are just nuisances over there. Sorry, everyone, for bumping the table. Mm. 
<laughs> it's taking a long time to finish. Had to check to make sure it wasn't on pause there. So, yeah. Defeating more Ray. See, but then I'll have to wait another 10 years to press another de jure claim. Unless I want to be considered a truth breaker, which I don't really need to, so. But oh well, we'll, we'll get around to it. If I usurp. If I take over two of them, I should be able to usurp the. Won't tell me. Should be able to usurp the uh, entire duchy after just two. How many men do I have here? They're annoying me. Go smash them. Bring them up here. He only holds one county here. That was a precarious ducal authority. Attack Ross between the two of us. Looks like it also has the less amount of men. Yep. That uh, Tiprate of Ubrian has been viciously sending him. Um. Oh, sure. set up this kingdom, or this empire. Nineteen sixty-three. It looks like it keeps on going up. It's, it's interesting. Now probably is Prince Elmar of Morel. All right. So, have I become a Sildor? Kingdom of Morel. It's really the Empire of Morel. The Morellian Empire. Okay. So I can dole out. Not one more. Two more commanders. The Ocean and Swithlade. Swithrid. Swithrid? Can create the Kingdom of Wales. Well, then I don't mind if I do. Oh, why isn't that considered part of the Oh, it's part of the king part of the Duchy of Meath. And he is my grandson, so guess what? You're now the King of Wales. Well, why does that go with it? Wait a second. Ah, oh, County Ergni. Um, oh, I can't revoke that vassalage. I can't revoke that title. Oh, who's Gorisanthe? Oh, who's Gormar? Count Gorisanthe is my kinsman as well. His father, Gorosante, was my grandson. Well, I'll give it to my younger grandson. That's all right. I now have a king under me. 
<laughs> All right, uh, further distribution of titles. Dead, dead. Ah. Duke Elmar of the Isles, and then his brother is Duke of Galloway. Well, then I will give him. No, that'll end my war. That wouldn't be good. Let's just keep the, the Kingdom of Scotland for a while. Until this war ends, at least. And then I can give him... Give him Scotland. Uh, sure. Your land to do as you wish. That's why I gave it to you. Magnetic. Oh, this getting primary. If ruler has no children, and law defaults to primogeniture. Okay. Crown authority. Low. Centralization. Low. Of course they would. Alright, so the Kingdom of Morales primogeniture. For right now, the Empire Morel is Gavilkind succession. We're whittling away at this war. Well, that brought us a lot closer. <laughs> you never know. You just just offer it. You never know what's going to happen. Ended. All right. So. This is now mine. Marais, part of the Duchy of Marais, what's up, which is up there. You don't even have a castle town? I mean, come on, people. So... I give him Kingdom of Scotland. Will to be everything there. He's over. Duchy of Albany and the Duchy of the Isles. He'd be able to wage his own wars. Get better, get a higher vassalage if I keep him happy. We'll wait on it. Uh, something just doesn't feel right there. I can create the Kingdom of Ireland now. I don't think I can still. I don't think I can destroy this kingdom. I can't destroy this title. Well, that's that's a problem with with the fantasy mod. I mean, I'd like to be able to, you know, to you know, I know I created this empire, but I'd like to be able to hold the Irish, Scottish, and Welsh crowns, because then I could do. Deserve the empire. So, so, and then there also, I can't create the Empire of Brittany, Britannia.
I could, because I already hold three of them. Then I could just de jure the whole English English uh, country there. go. Excellent. <laughs> I think he finally found, finally saw the errors of his ways. He shall swear fealty. Excellent. Didn't even have to draw a bow. Or draw an arrow, I should, I should say. What, what are you going to work? What, what can I offer you? No, you still don't want to? And this guy won't. He's not. He's not a ditcher. Alrighty. Let's see here. You know, so uh, why won't he base her? Elmara Burwick has been viciously slandering me. That's fine. <clears throat> That's a good thing. I'm so happy that Northumberland decided to, to become my vassal. And that almost... Oh, well, it is 30. I just, I just have the retinue costs. Alright, so Deadcast also said that my retinue cap is increased, and it is. Very good. So these Elvish archers are considered special. Oh, they are special units. Ransom prisoner. Um, sure. What the heck was he prisoner? With cola, nonetheless. All right, let's see technology here. Oh, I thought this was getting pretty high. Um, castle infrastructure gives me barracks, castle tax, brew keeps, trade practices. Keeps, religious customs, heavy infantry. Let's get those. I was hoping a military organization would be up there, but still ahead by too much. Right, am I not on a major trade node yet? Where's my trade? Treats it. No one set up trade yet. Governments. Feudal. Alright, just seeing what that was. Um, look at that economy. Well, sure, they're in Shrewsbury, but my economy's thriving. Uh, cultures, no. So it's not going to tell me, it's not going to show me trade routes here. I guess I'm going to have to go through and figure out if any of these are on a... Oh, but a fort. So I'm still not on... I'm not located on a major trade route. But wouldn't it up here be... Excuse me. Even that's not true in Middlesex. Hmm. 
because the trade posts really helped me out. I mean, I know I'm not a merchant public, but that would definitely help me out a lot. <clears throat> thousand plus another eight thousand plus from vassals that's if I could do math that's 27 thousand basically and then we go down here to this empire and he can command 45 thousand so clearly I have a long way to go now he does have more land and my okay he has been stopped basically He's waiting right now. Need England. <laughs> he's O'Brien. Yeah, he's my grandson. be for the next episode when I do that. Command 17,000. That'll be a battle for show. So let's build this up. I need keeps up here in Northern Ireland. Not even paying attention to This looks like a good stopping point right here as we make preparations for the invasion of, of England here. And we'll start off with Profitable. Um, lots of claims I can make. And that's always a good thing when you have lots of claims. I'm not going to create the Kingdom of Ireland. Well, I can't create these now. Don't want to create the, this duchy. I guess I no, these two are mine. What's his what's his limit? You know what? I'll give him a great Gwent. The Isle of Man. It is Scottish, okay. So he can no. No, he could create that duchy. Okay. So he can become the, that dude. That's what I wanted anyways. So now, dropped by a thousand men. That rose by about 400. So that's just something I have to live with. I'll recoup those. Castle walls, yes, sir. Dunbar, no. Just more about technology spread here, seeing if I can update the walls, which doesn't seem not a lot has been spread. Ulster, am I doing something here? Yeah, the castle walls. Alright, everyone. Well, another good episode for everyone. Um, if you like what you see, feel free to click on the thumbs up, as well as leaving a comment to that effect if you need to if you want to if you think that I should be looking at something else 
um, go ahead and let me know in the comments as well. As always, click on the red subscribe button. It lets me know that I'm doing a good job and that you want to see more of what I'm producing. Till next time, everyone. Good night and good luck.